Hello everyone, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install Tailwind CSS in Vue project. Okay, this is my application. I have made a fresh installation of Vue 3 with feed. Okay, if you go to the source code, you will see feed.config.js is used in Vue 3. Actually, in the past, we use Webpack. Right now, we use feed.config.js. And this is the default website of Vue. So I will clean it up first. Okay, let me clean this up. So we can remove this one. Okay. And in main, we can remove this as well. Remove everything from main. And for component, I will delete them all. So icon, I can delete this as well. I want to show only hello world on our application. Okay, and this one, we can remove this one. Okay, this one, I will show only hello world. Let me remove this one. And create div hello view with tailwind. Okay. And for CSS over here, I can delete them all. Save. Okay, let's go back to our application. You will see something like this by default. Okay, next I will get start install Tailwind on our project. So how to use uh, Tailwind CSS in feed projects? You go to documentation, tailwindcss.com and then go to docs and then go to uh, framework guides and go to feed. And over here, there are two tab, react or view. So in this case, we are using view. We've already created view projects, all right? We will skip step one. Let's jump into step two. Step two, you have to run this command to install Tailwind on your project. Copy it. Okay, let's go back to Visual Studio Code. We have to stop our project. Control C and then type Y, hit enter. Then paste the command over here, hit enter. Then if you go to package.json, you will see that Tailwind CSS has been installed in our projects already. Okay, the next step, you need to run this command to create two files. The first one is tailwind.config.cjs and postcss.config.cjs. Okay, let's paste this command over here. Hit enter. You will see two files are created tailwind.config.js and postcss.config.js okay the next thing that you have to do you have to add uh, the view path okay which is this one you can just copy the content over here copy it and then go to tailwind.config.js you replace the content that you just copy over here okay and you will get something like this okay the next thing, you have to create styles.css. But in this case, I don't want to create styles. I can use main.css. Okay, just copy this one. Or you just write remove main.css. Okay. And then let me create styles.css. I just paste tailwind over here. So we include tailwind in our project. And the next thing that you have to do, you have to include styles.css into main.js. And you can remove this one because we have removed it from our projects. Or you can just change this to be styles. Okay, save. And then what else you have to do? You have to run npm run dev. Okay, let's run npm run dev. Hit enter. Okay. Okay, next let's try our first tailwind. For example, text 3xl font bow and underline. Copy it and go to our app.view, put class over here, paste the tailwind CSS over here. Okay, let's take a look at our application. Okay, let me put background color BG 
red 200 save okay this work all right this is all about this tutorial if you like this video don't forget to click like subscribe and comment down below thank you so much for watching